Now there's one key thing which defines high performance in a team environment. Who's heard of that term called synergy? Yeah, what does it mean? Working together, Working together to create what? A greater, outcome. a greater outcome than the sum of the individuals can create on their own, right? So if I was to give you a rowing analogy, because in rowing it really works well, in terms of like I rowed in a boat with four people. Okay, now if one plus one plus one plus one, if we have a synergistic team, what should that add up to? Hopefully. If it adds up to six, you win a gold medal. If it adds up to 5.8, maybe you don't And So synergy, final. once again, is defined by one key thing. Like if you're in a, a basketball team or a soccer team or, you know, there's sports when you can really see it clearly, but the best athlete on your team never outperforms your team. What does that mean? So the star player, and every team has their star player, but the star player never outperforms the team. Like we've got a sport, have you heard of cricket? Okay, it's an international sport, but you guys don't play it. <laughs> <laughs> but cricket is a sport that most Australians love. And uh, we had a situation the other day where our captain of our cricket team, playing against South Africa with the number one team, right. the test team in the world, we were playing the number one team in the world and we we're currently ranked number two. Now we beat them in this test series. If we beat them, we become the number one nation again. And we've been up there for uh, such a long time, but we've recently slipped down the rankings. Now our captain scored what we call a double century. And that basically means you score more than 200 runs. Now that basically is gonna take you two days at the crease batting to score a double century. Now he did it in two test matches in a row, one in Brisbane, one in Adelaide. But what about the team? Did the team win? The team didn't win. It was a draw on both occasions. But the captain of the Australian team, two double centuries, that is something that no cricketer in the history of the sport has ever done. Two test matches in a row. And yet the team didn't win. That's not synergy. It's good performance, but it's not synergy, is it? <coughs> okay. And so the challenge with creating this is working out, well, if you have a star player or star players, you know, how do you best leverage off everyone else on the team so they can be as good as they can be? But where the star player's statistics are never greater than the team's result. You know, that's what defines a high-performing team. And it's pretty rare to get there.